So today I'm here with Jake. Hey, Bobby. And what we're working on is the verbal down. So what I want her to do is while he's in a seated position, we know that if you do this, he lays down. Very nice. So the way in which we get a dog to pay attention to our voice is by incorporating a pause. Come here, buddy. Jake, down. Yes. It's essentially by giving the command and allowing time for him to figure out what it is we want. So, this is how we don't do it. If I say the command and show him the answer at the same time. Jake, down. Yes. If I said down and showed him the answer at the same time, down. He will never listen to my voice. So. Jake, here. Jake, sit. Yes. That's right, it's Jake, touch, right? One second. Jake, touch. You want to cook the boy. Okay. Jake, down. Yes. So if for, for some particular reason he doesn't pay attention to my voice, I say Jake down and he doesn't do it, then I show him the answer by, by pointing to the ground. And that's really a good thing, having that visual cue. Because let's say you take him out and about and you say Jake down and he looks like he has no idea what you're talking about. You can do this and it will help remind him, oh, that's what she's talking about. That's what he's talking about. And we'll lay down nice. Jake down. Yes. Very good. Very good, buddy. So this concept of pausing applies to sit, down, come, go to bed, all these different commands. Good stuff, Jake.